Hi there. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create higher quality articles with Article Forge, stop Article Forge from writing about things that you don't want it to include, and even how to create articles that are 4,500 plus words and even all the way up to 10,000 words. And we'll do this with real examples. So let's jump right in. So for this first example, since we're doing a lot of machine learning here, I wanted to write a blog post about it. Now I'd recommend not simply entering machine learning as your keyword. Article Forge does better when it knows your intent. What type of machine learning article do you want it to write about? And for longer articles, like what we'll be doing here, Article Forge does even better if you write your keyword in a way that describes a list of some sort. So in this case, I'll do applications of machine learning. Article Forge can then write about several of these different applications. You could also do something like companies doing machine learning, where it could list some of these companies, or best machine learning algorithms, or kind of anything else in this more listicle style, which I think gets the best results. So let's skip ahead to the article being done so I don't bore you with loading bars. Uh, looks like a great article. Uh, I didn't do any editing on this article, and honestly, you could probably just copy and paste this on your blog and you're good to go. I'm skimming through it right now, and I don't really see anything bad about it. Um, I guess the only thing that I do notice is, uh, let's say this blog post is for a startup machine learning research organization. This company might be competing with DeepMind, which is heavily featured in this article. I don't want my post talking about my competitors. So I'll go back to the article page and do the same keyword, but I'm going to add Google and DeepMind both as excluded topics. Uh, when you do this, it basically instructs Article Forge to not talk about them. And now we'll skip ahead again, and the article is done. And here we go, another awesome article, and this time I don't see DeepMind or Google mentioned anywhere. And again, this article looks really good. I'm having trouble seeing any issues. I'm sure if you pause the video, maybe you could find a couple small things, but I'm thinking this would just be a minute or two tops of proofreading, and then you're ready to publish. Now, I wanna talk about how we can write a really, really long article. That last article was 750 words, and that's long, but we can go longer. So let's say I have this mega article I wanna write about. Um, best workouts for each muscle group. So I could go into Article Forge, enter best workouts for each muscle group, which has that good list format I mentioned before. And in this case, I'll go for the very long setting, um, which is long, still not as long as we're going to get, but long. And I'll even add the muscle groups myself to make sure Article Forge covers them all. Best leg workouts, best back workouts, best chest workouts, best shoulder workouts, best arm workouts, best core workouts, etc. cetera. And uh, we'll generate the article, uh, we'll skip to the end, and once again, the article looks awesome. Uh, for these longer articles, by writing our keyword in that list format, uh, we're able to get some really high quality long form content. And by writing the outline ourselves, uh, we're able to get even higher quality content since we're able to really instruct Article Forge on what direction to take the article in. So let's take this though a step further. Let's see if we can write something that is over 4,000 words long. So I'm going to do things a little differently this time. I'm going to take each of those sections we just wrote and make them into their own 750 word article. So I'll quickly go through and create an article for best core workouts, best arm workouts, best chest workouts, etc. Bear with me while I'm doing this all. And for each of these articles, I'm going to make each of the other muscle groups a negative topic. So uh, for instance, there's some exercises that are good for both shoulders and arms, but I don't want Article Forge to get repetitive and talk about it in both of the different articles. I want the arm stuff to talk only about arm stuff. I want the shoulder stuff to talk only about shoulder stuff. So with these excluded topics, we can make sure each of our mini articles stays focused on the topic at hand and makes our articles less repetitive. Finally, I'll create a 50 word article with the keyword, intro to the best weightlifting exercises for each muscle group, which can serve as maybe our 50 word intro paragraph that we can put at the beginning. Now all these are running. Um, once again, I'll skip ahead. So now all of our articles are done. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into the My Articles tab and I'm going to select all the articles I just created and click Combine. Uh, we've now got a new article with all of them merged together. I'm going to scroll to the bottom area. The top, it just shows you one at a time. So I'm going to scroll to the bottom area where you can see all the articles one by one by one. They're split up here with these pipes. So I'm just going to remove the pipes. And now we have this full article. Uh, once again, the article looks really solid. And the word count is 4,443 words. Not bad for about 30 seconds of entering keywords. 
And I guess I could have made this article even longer if I wanted. I could have made those sections 1,500 words each instead of 750. Although in that case, I would definitely recommend using your own outlines as that will really help increase the quality. So if you really wanted to, you could have easily turned this into a nearly 10,000 word monster article, still with no more than five minutes of actual work, and then maybe another five minutes at the end proofreading. So I hope that helps show you how you can use the new Article Forge 4.0 to create awesome looking articles anywhere from 50 words all the way to 4,500 or even 10,000 words. And if you do find that for whatever reason Article Forge isn't giving you articles that look as good as these, I would recommend playing around with the keyword a little bit. Changing workout to best workouts for each muscle group makes a huge difference, as does in this case adding your own listicle style outline items. This helps Article Forge truly understand what you're trying to write, which makes it easier for Article Forge to return back an awesome article for you. So with these tips, I'm confident Article Forge will be able to give you incredible long form content with the push of a button. So thanks for watching and happy forging.